Hello uh, and welcome to the October real estate market report for the GTA. So we're going to cover six cities today. We're going to cover Mississauga, Oakville, Milton, Burlington, Toronto, and Brampton. Any other areas or cities that you would like a report for, please reach out to us and we will be more than glad to um, create a report for you based on that city. Also, we have uh, a few more detailed reports on our website, which you could also check the market reports there. Um, okay, so let's get started. Again, this is uh, Ricardo Maderos with Remax Real Estate Center, and um, we are just breaking down a basic overall market report for October of 2020. Now, when we have average prices, uh, as you, we're going to mention here, it's basically across the board, so we're putting into consideration detached homes, semi-detached homes, freehold, townhomes, and condos. Uh, if you want to, again, a detailed report on, let's say, a detached only in a specific area, we'll definitely do an in-depth uh, report for you uh, or an actual in-depth for your own home in your area. Okay, so let's get on uh, with uh, our market report for October 2020. So we'll start off with uh, Toronto. <clears throat> so there were 8,623 active listings for the month of October of 2020, 3,514 sales for the month of October. The average sale price across the board, 1,025,925, and the average days in the market, 17. You could also uh, pay attention here to the left and you'll have an average price for, for different cities all over um, Southern Ontario. Okay, let's go on to the next one, which is Oakville. So the active listings for October was 563. The Actual sales sold were 390. The average sale price 1,313,481. And average days in the market 21. We'll go on to Mississauga. So Mississauga's October numbers are 1,527 active listings, 943 sales. Average price across the board 878, 276. And the average days in the market was 16. We'll go on to, uh, to Milton. So Milton had 156 active listings and 250 sales. If you're wondering why there was more sales than active listings, it's because some listings um, are carried over. Um, so you might see a difference in, uh, in listings from one month to another. So there may have been some more listings in September that carried over to October, and that resulted in more sales for October. Average sale price across the board, 916717 and average days in the market, 14 Let's go on to Burlington. So Burlington had 321 active listings, 374 sales. The average price across the board, 891844 Average days in the market, 17 and lastly, we'll finish off with Brampton, 940 active listings, 1,096 solds, average price, of, price across the board, 865,509, average days in the market, 14. Okay, so this was just a recap of six cities in the GTA. Again, here are some average prices for Southern Ontario. If you have a particular area, a particular type of home you want us to do an evaluation for, there is no obligation, please send us a message with the address and your email and name and we will send you one out. And uh, any questions regarding buying or selling real estate or good investments, uh, we are here to help with all your real estate needs. We specialize in residential and commercial as well as land. So uh, reach out to us anytime. Again, it's Ricardo Maderos with Remax Real Estate Center and wishing you all the best, stay safe. Thank you for watching, bye-bye.